If you don't got no sauce, then you, you, you're lost. Mm -hmm. But you can also get lost in the sauce. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back for another episode. We're again back here in the shop, and we are working on Alyssa's car. Um, I don't know if you guys uh, saw the no prep event, the last video uh, that we watched, um, but there's a lot of other videos out there. You guys should just pay attention to the story. Um, some guy lost like five grand that night. It was it was pretty sweet. Uh, Tampa versus Orlando. So go ahead and watch SP Tuning's video and. I think the nice ones were out there and a couple other people. So go ahead and check out their video. I'll go ahead and put it right there, my video, so you guys can go ahead and take a take a peek. So anyways, uh, we haven't made too much progress uh, with the CRX, or the, sorry, the EF since last time you guys saw her. So we're gonna just start recording um, for where we left off. I did take a lot of stuff off of the CRX, as you can see her, actually me and Brian, that's my buddy Tanner, chilling out, okay. emotional support here. <laughs> um, so we just went ahead and took everything off of the CRX, like the traction bar, uh, fuel lines. Um, we went ahead and got an RSX uh, uh, Type S intake manifold. That way we can get the hood to close because Alyssa really wanted a hood that closed. So we're going to make sure to make that happen. But anyways, and the axles and so forth. So we're just going to go ahead and get her going. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and start with the intake manifold. Uh, I want to let you guys know uh, real fast what I did because I've already made a video of it uh, before. I don't want to keep making videos of obviously me doing the same thing again. Uh, this uh, coolant bypass, you got to go ahead and cut the gasket. If you're wondering how that's done, go ahead and check the video and I'll put that link right there uh, when I made it. Um, so this, uh, you got to take off, put the intake manifold on, and this sits right uh literally right next to it. Uh, and you have to do this to be able to run an RSX intake manifold um, on a K24 head. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the RSX intake manifold off, on, sorry, on, and then you guys can see uh, how much clearance we have uh, with it. So. You can see with the RSX uh, intake manifold, you definitely got a lot more clearance and we'll be able to finally get the hood to close. Um, these mounts also are the reason um, that it is able to close. Like if you see my uh, mounts that I have on my CRX, ones that were a lot cheaper, uh, the innovative uh, mounts, they sit up way, way, way higher. So that hood will never close. Anyways, we'll get back to it. So now I'm going to go ahead and get the uh, fuel rail on. Just get a couple other things in here on. And then me and Brian are going to go ahead and get those cables in.
All right, so we have made some progress. We went ahead and got all the axles in. You saw Brian doing that a few minutes ago. Uh, we went ahead and got the uh, fuel lines in as well. Um, I went ahead and got the coil packs in uh, and everything. Uh, radiator got in, and also we just put the intercooler on just to mock up uh, and see what it looks like, and it looks extremely dope, no lie. So anyways, let's go ahead and uh, get it going. I'm just gonna put the manifold, the turbo manifold on for now just to see what she looks like. Bam, and the manifold is on. We actually went ahead and pulled the cars out and cleaned them and just rearranged them so we had some more room in the shop, but it is looking good. Really all we need to do is obviously get it out for the intercooler piping, um, brake lines, we still gotta finish those. I still need to finish the wiring. Um, I'm actually gonna be coming back tomorrow um, just kind of ran out of daylight. So I'm gonna come back tomorrow. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and bolt in the uh, OEM Accord uh, shifter and we're gonna put the cables in and everything. So we'll go ahead and do that tomorrow. Alrighty guys, I'm gonna go ahead and call the video there. I'm gonna come back tomorrow and you know, get them shifter cables in. Uh, go ahead and like, subscribe. See you guys soon. Peace. If you don't got no sauce then you, 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 you're lost. Mm -hmm. But you can also get lost in the sauce.